Hello Divine Souls, welcome to my channel, Twin Flames Exposed. My name is Terry. I hope you guys are safe and doing well. If you're new to my channel, welcome. And if you are returning, welcome back. So let's take a look to see what's going on with the collective's finances and career. You have the Eight of Pentacles. So this is all about starting your own business. You could be changing your job or thinking about changing careers. But this is a very beautiful card because it's all about success and your hard work paying off. Someone is also working on something very diligently. It could be a project. It could be starting your own business, trying to get it off the ground. This could also be someone going back to school or someone is in school. You could be learning a new skill as well. You could be picking up a trade. Someone here looks like they're trying to get certified in something. Someone also makes things with their hands, but whatever you're doing is going to be very successful. Your next card is the Two of Cups. So that's all about partnerships and collaboration. Maybe you're thinking about going into business with someone, a friend, a family. Maybe it's a family business. Or maybe it's going into business with your significant other. But this is all about a business agreement. And whoever this person is, you're going to be getting along with them. Because the Two of Cups is all about peace and harmony. And it looks like you're going to be finding love if you're single through this job or new business. And I'm also seeing that if you guys are in a chaotic situation, a negative environment, a job that's not fulfilling, you have something coming in because I'm seeing that you guys are not happy. Your next card is the world. So this is all about fulfillment, achievements, contentment, and a completion. This is also walking away from a situation that's no longer serving you, ending a cycle. A lot of you have applied for jobs. You're waiting to hear back from an employer. And I also feel like with this world card, you're just wanting to venture out and do things on your own. Someone here could have a government job. You could be in politics. You could have a nonprofit organization. You could be a travel agent or work for the airlines. Or you could also have a work from home job. Someone is also on social media. You have a platform and you make content. Or you could just be thinking about wanting to open up your own channel. Someone here is also moving for a job or changing residence. And for some of you, you had a lot of goals that you wanted to achieve when the year started. And I feel like you're sticking to it. For some of you, it could be paying off debt, paying off credit cards, paying off your car loan, and also spending less and saving more. But whatever you're doing, you're very committed to it because the world card is all about a new beginning, celebration, prosperity, and promotion. And it's also about your goals being fulfilled. So I'm going to be pulling some cards from my finances and career deck. What is going on with the collective right now? Your first card is interview. So for those of you who have sent out resumes, you're going to be getting an interview. For some of you, this is also going to be a virtual interview. And this is coming in very quickly. Your next card is retirement. So for some of you, you are in retirement or you will be retiring this year. And that's why the world card came up because you're thinking about traveling during your retirement. You have a lot of plans. And for some of you during this retirement, you're wanting to open up your own business. This retirement could also just be you walking away from a job that no longer serves you, retiring from corporate America and venturing out on your own. Your next card says, do your research. So with this interview coming up, it's saying for you to do your research. Make sure you're dotting all your I's and crossing all your T's just to make sure that this company is very reputable. Your next card is learning a new skill and that's what I was getting. Some of you are going back to school. You're picking up a trade. You're getting certified in something, but you're learning a new skill. Your next card says unhappy in current situation and that's why you're making changes. Some of you are walking away from this dead end job and you're venturing out on your own and you're trying to find something better that's going to pay you more and has a lot more benefits. And for some of you, you are going to be getting a promotion. Your next card is legal issues. So for some of you, you are going through some kind of legal issue, but the outcome is going to be turning out in your favor because the two of cups is all about peace, joy, harmony, and finding balance. And for some of you, you're very stressed out about this legal matter but it's going to be turning out in your favor. Your next card is inheritance. 
So for some of you, this could be the legal issue here. Some of you are going to be receiving an inheritance and this could be tied up in the court. Someone could have passed away without a will and that could be what this legal issue is. This inheritance doesn't necessarily mean someone passed away. It could also mean that someone is gifting you something and for some of you, it's going to be some kind of unexpected check, some kind of unexpected income or a windfall. And your last card is entrepreneur. And that's what I was picking up on. You guys are wanting to go out and do your own thing. You're tired of working for people. You're wanting to open up your own business. And for those of you, if you are already an entrepreneur and your business has been stagnant, there's going to be a turnaround in your finances with the Eight of Pentacles and the world. That stagnancy is coming to an end because for some of you, I'm seeing that you're trying to revamp this business. You're doing something different which is why the Eight of Pentacles came out, because that's someone working very hard on a project. You're doing something different. And this Eight of Pentacles could also be multiple streams of income. For some of you, you already have a business and you're opening up another business. But whatever you're doing, your hard work is going to pay off because the World card is all about prosperity and goals being fulfilled. So that was very beautiful. All right, let's get you some final messages to wrap this up. So if you guys are worried about money, you have some kind of unexpected income coming in. A lot of you are going to be changing jobs or career and you're going to be very happy with the two of cups. For some of you, you're walking away from a dead end job and you're going to take the leap of faith and venture out into entrepreneurship. I'm seeing that for some of you, you're trying to get an LLC and you're trying to get some kind of paperwork for your business. That could also be why the legal issues is here. And for some of you, if you are collaborating with a partner and things did not go well, that could also be why the legal issue is here. You're trying to break free from that partnership and venture out on your own. So if you were worried about these legal issues, like I said, it's going to turn out in your favor. Let's get you a couple of messages to wrap this up. I'm going to be using the Angel of Abundance Oracle cards. What final messages do you have for the collective regarding their finances and career? Your first card says cooperation instead of competition. What's yours is yours. No one can take it from you. There's no need to compete as there's an abundance for all. You have complete access to unlimited abundance for yourself and to share with others. With cooperative partnerships, you can accomplish anything. So this card is pretty much saying that if you're scared to venture out on your own due to competition, not to worry because there's an abundance for everyone and what's for you is for you. So don't be scared and take that leap of faith. Your next card says, ask for your needs to be met. And it says, God and the angels can come to your aid only if you make a free will choice to be helped. And it begins with asking. It doesn't matter how you ask God for help but only that you do so. The same holds true with clearly asking other people to assist you. So that's very beautiful. So for some of you, it's saying that you need to ask for help. Pray to your higher power for guidance because that's where you're going to find all your answers. And by you asking for help, God is going to direct your path. All right, let's get one more card. You have windfall of abundance. An increase in abundance is arriving in many different forms, some of them unexpected. Be open to receiving and know that this abundance comes to you to support your life purpose, health, and charitable work. What did I tell you guys? You have unexpected money coming in. And I also stated that someone here does nonprofit organization work or charitable work, and your business is going to be picking up. But there's some kind of windfall of abundance coming your way. And like I was stating earlier, if your business was stagnant or has slowed down, it's going to pick back up. And I'm also seeing a career change and promotion, but you have a windfall of abundance coming in. If you guys have enjoyed this message, please give it a thumbs up. Make sure you're subscribed to the channel so when I upload new content, you'll be notified. Have an awesome day. Love and light always.